Hi guys, I'm back. Uh, I started doing a video earlier, but I was stuck in traffic and it ended up uh, being way too long. So start this up again. Um, so I don't feel like editing the crap out of the whole video. So here we are, another day, another video. And yes, um, vaping again on another day of uh, Tropic Cool by Bradford. I reckon my coils could take another day, so, and they have. They have taken another day, which is bonus. I'll just have to re-wick tonight, or try to swap out our DTAs tonight. But, what I really, really um, wanted to chat about, and this is a similar sort of situation um, for yesterday's video. I mean, I'd say go take a look at it. It was the whole RDTA dripper thing. Expensive mods. Now, in particular, DNA. Yes, the, the new the DNA uh, 75C and the 266C. Now, those are the color display um, chips from DNA. Uh, any day now, a uh, new um, software, firmware update is coming out, and you're going to be able to have a replay function. Now, the replay function pretty much replays um, a, a hit you take, and it's apparently going to mean then it's going to be that exact same hit every single time. So you, f you get that hit on that tank or that dripper that did wonders. I don't know how it's going to do it. Don't know if it's going to be duration or it's just going to be temperature and wattage and, and, and matchy matchy. But apparently it's going to be the best thing since last bread. And I don't have a problem with that. Um, if you want to fiddle around with that. But I don't understand DNA chips. Um, now the DNA chip obviously is the electronics inside your device. Allows you to change some functions. DNA chips have a lot more functions. And a lot more fiddling to them. But the problem is... Uh, price now um, DNA chips have always been hellishly expensive and yes some of the mods they come in are very pretty but I can't conceive the um, Why I want, why I would want to pay that extra amount just for a chip that's going to maybe do a little bit extra, and a chip that's going to do a hell of a lot extra that I'm never going to use. It's the whole. My father has a smartphone. He doesn't need a smartphone. If he could carry around a rotary telephone, he would. But he can't. He uses it as a phone. Everything else is wasted on. Facebook doesn't use Facebook. WhatsApp doesn't use WhatsApp. Um, email, nope. It's a phone. I have to check SMSs and shit for him when he gets there. If he wants a phone, he wants a phone. Now it's it's similar to like me. A mod is a mod. I mean, you got. The functions I'm going to use, wattage mode, it's about it. Wattage mode, I never use temperature control mode, which is a lot more fiddly in the DNA and you can set specific settings to your likings and stuff. But I don't use it. Um, curve feature, yeah maybe. I use curve every now and again, but I've got other devices that run curve. I mean, I've got three other devices that run curve. My Minikin V2, my Minikin Reborn, and 
I don't even know if my name, but and my Tesla Punk 220. All of them have curve features, which I don't use very often, to be fair. So everything everything else is gonna be lost on me. It's it's gonna be yeah, it's fantastic and yeah this device can do this and that and the other, but I'm not going to use it. Yeah, and, and a lot of the DNA devices to me are actually damn ugly and hellishly expensive. So there's there's the new Mir uh, Mirage, which turns out to be a damn nice looking mod. Uh, it's got the DNA 75C chip. Now that's 75 watts. It takes one battery. It can take an 18650 or 2700 battery. It's a nice device, comfy in hand, but it's 1,900 rand last time I checked. 1,900 rand. What can I get for 1,900 rand? For 1,900 rand, I can pick up, which is to me a pretty damn bulletproof setup. Um, Minikin Reborn it's pretty nice and nice to hold in the hand it's got um, enough features that I'm going to use and more plus I can throw in a set of damn decent batteries in there as well and a damn nice tank and and yeah I'll have the I'll have the pick of the litter I mean going through the new ones that are absolutely fantastic the Zeus, the Carlin Mini uh, the Blitzen I won't buy them but then I can run that setup or I can buy a nice, nice dripper or, 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 or I can buy a complete uh, squonking setup and then some for that kind of money single battery but why I'd go Minikin Reborn is first of all two batteries a longer battery life that is a big must for me and if I'm actually gonna pick up an actual mod because I do like long battery life but I do like my mech squonkers which means it's a Cash 22 Mech Squonk is single battery, not not very good battery life. But I understand why I'm not getting uh, good battery life. It's because it's one battery giving all it can take every single hit, and it's small enough for me to carry around some extra batteries. 75C, yeah. If you're running it at 30 watts, it's going to get you through the day. But that's not always going to be the case so I can get a two battery mod that's definitely going to last me the entire day and then some maybe if I'm running a low wattage build so yeah that's my little rant on I don't see the point of these stupid expensive devices if I'm going to buy one it better more than anything else it's got to A, hit hard. In wattage mode, that's all I'm looking for. B, two batteries, but you know what, I'd, I'd, I'd go for one if it, but it must look, look nice. It must look damn pretty. It must feel nice in my hand. It must be, it must be a lot of things. It must be a lot of things for me to actually go you know what I'm gonna buy this it must be a lot and I think it must be more than what any mod anywhere could offer and I'm talking about 20 30 grand mods I mean it must be a lot to offer for me to get it and I don't think anything out on the market is offering 
what I would look for in an expensive device. So yeah. Uh, me ranting about shit. So yeah. There are a lot of things. I mean and the only reason I mean I, I don't see the point of 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 a lot of things and I, I don't know if I don't think the way other people think but uh, someone that, that runs bloody expensive mods <clears throat> and yes they look damn damn pretty I mean no 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 two ways about it these things are these mods are absolutely gorgeous but and that's the problem that's right there there is a but but I don't see Uh, oh, fucking far away. Yeah. Um, I'm where I am. Not where I want it to be, but... Uh, uh, I would have been stuck in traffic. If I'd gone where I wanted to go. And I don't think I could have gone there in time. So there's my little uh, mod rant for the day. So until next time, keep it cloudy.